And this is Hopkins White? That's Hopkins White. Yes. And it's really wet. That's the one you just did. This is a really wet slab. So I'm doing everything you're not supposed to do. Okay, so I did the little diaper. That way I can kind of, I don't think it, for this one it doesn't matter to me where I put it. Okay, and then we want to take a piece of paper. We'll use this as a block to go over. Did you like this? Oh yeah, that'll work. Thanks. Oh, wax. Oh, that's a. Uh, I keep forgetting to bring the wax paper. This oh. is vellum. So I'm, all I'm going to do is use my finger first just to see what happens. Because I have no idea. I just want to get an idea to see how it's. <laughs> This clay is very wet. See, it's it's transferring pretty well. I haven't given it much pressure. I need it, yeah, I'm gonna have to think. It's a little fuzzy on the little lines. Okay. Yeah, I knew I did that. Thought so. Yeah, it doesn't really do anything. It's just a crease in texture. You can try it, but it's almost, yeah, I was going to say, that might be It's just smoother. Yeah, it's not I think you get better results if the clay is a little firmer than this, a lot firmer, actually, you know, but for now, that's okay. And why is that? Because of that I think it's just a little too wet. The oil tends to repel off the surface because this is so damp, you know, a little bit, but. I mean, the first ones I did, I did just like this, and got some pretty nice results. So. But I found I can print more stuff by... This is actually texturing the clay, so... Yeah. Okay, so once you kind of get most of the water off of that, I could possibly come back here. And it's, the spoon works really well. It's not, you know, tearing the paper. It'd be nice if you could just leave the paper on here, which you can, I've done it, but the clay shrinks and then the paper kind of buckles, and then when you fire it, it can fall down in a different place and leave a different yeah. mark, which I guess could be fun, but for this kind of stuff, it's rarely going to be a good thing. And when I was working today in my paper, it separated this way. So there's chunks of paper left on my slab. And was, the just, paper just didn't hold up. Yeah. Maybe you're using that other paper? We're using the old paper? Or, I, what, what paper were you using, do you know? When I came in, I think the first copies I did, I used the paper that was in the tray. Mm -hmm. Which and could have been the stuff we used the old last been, time. Um, that stuff I, I worked not today. That's what contaminated our ink last time. Yep. Let's just see what it looks like. Yeah, see I did move it there, but actually it's kind of nice. Okay, so that's a pretty decent transfer, actually. Mm, they're going to get that exactly. Yeah, right. and it'll come out like that. Right? See, now what I don't care for is this, this No, but, the well then now right? I'll go back and do something to this, right? But I mean, this is, uh, we're also getting the transfer of the background, this. You mean the shape, the template?